What is up guys, Johnny here. Today I got a guide for you guys on how to beat the Voltaic Fist dungeon in Shadowgun Legends. So when you start the dungeon, you will see elevators on your left. If you check it out, you will see that the access is denied. So you'll have to find another way to get there. So you will go straight ahead and you will have uh, your first big fight if you want in the dungeon. So just clear the enemies and move ahead. Now you will see on the left uh, this big screen over there with four red squares. So that means you got four things to unlock. The first one will be straight ahead on the left. Alright, so if you turn left at the end you will see uh, lock A. So just click on that, lock A, disengage, and you will see one of the four red squares turn green. Uh, if you go back to the starting area where you got these four red squares, you will see this door there. Just shoot the barrels, make the door open. There you go, here you see elevator now online. So now you go back to the starting area, you will go back up into the elevators. But here the excess is still denied. But you can go to the right elevator, as you will see, it is now working. Call in the elevator, get back in, and down. Once you reach uh, that area, there will be a bunch of lasers. So you can try and go all the way without getting detected. Uh, it is possible because we did it. And at the end of that, you will see lock D. Just go there, click that thing. And that's two out of four. Now at the other end of the corridor, you will see another door, and it is locked. It will see uh, you will see when you click on it. It says Basin flooded door locked. But there's a barrier here. Shoot these two things at the top. And that will open the barrier. Go right. There's kind of a computer there. Click on that. Now you will have a hacking sequence. Once you're done breaching, it will say Basin draining in progress can go back now it says bass and drain so you're good to go you can open that door we we'll have another fight there once you're done with the fight go straight ahead turn left and there will be another door now check out on the left there's a key card or card key there key card obtain you will need that now at the end of that you will see a room with a reactor. So if you go behind the reactor, you will see a switch there. That switch would disable the laser, so it's important to click on that. And then at the other end, you will see another lock. So that will be lock C. That's three out of four now. Now go back to the starting area. When you see these locks, go left. You will see the final one. It's right over there past the reactors. This is lock B. It's now open. You can go there. And there you go. That is four unlocked. Now you will be able to open the door to the reactor chamber. So go back to the starting area and you will see four uh, green squares now. So you can click on that. You'll have another uh, 10 seconds to breach. Now when you're done breaching, you will see some green lights left and right. Just go there, click on one of these two. There you go, reactor chamber open. Now you will have a major fight there, so just be prepared. Uh, there will be a lot of enemies to fight. After the fight, you're in a big room with four locks. Uh, you have to open them in the right order. The order is four, two, three, one. So just go there, uh, click in the right order, four, two, three, one, and you will see the big door open at the end. You will also get some loot in the middle, so don't forget to grab your loot. There you go. So all uh, four things need to be green at the same time. So it's also a matter of timing. It's just not a code. Uh, if you open too slow or too fast, it's not going to work. But there you go. Big door is open. And grab your loot in the middle. Now you have to wait a little bit for the animation. 
then jump in the portal it's the warp gate and then you'll have the final boss now you have to slay general regis all right so you see left and right there are some little barricades there there's no way it's gonna damage you if you're standing very close to these barricades the best strategy will be you stand behind one and your teammates stand behind the other uh so when the general is looking at your teammate you can shoot the general in the back there's a little circle in the back this is the only way to get damage on the general because as you can see if you shoot in the front it's gonna do zero damage at all so wait for the general to turn around and shoot it in the back that's where you do uh the most of the damage now after a little while if you do a bit of damage on the general it will stop to recharge look at the screens of the top it says a so that means you have to find quickly door a jump right in and you will see a switch you can close the doors but wait for your stupid teammates because uh if they die you're not gonna be able to uh finish the job of course this guy uh caesar did not watch my video so he has no idea what to do i wait for him he doesn't join so there's no way we're gonna survive we're gonna die so we're gonna have to do it again all right so you go back again you do some damage on the general it's gonna stop to charge check the screen at the top now it says c go ahead enter door c wait for your stupid teammates to join you and of course he didn't watch my video so he's gonna like circle around like an idiot he's gonna try to take cover in the wrong door i'm waiting for him but he's just not gonna come in time so of course we're gonna die again but this boss is very easy if your teammate watch my video there you go we die again all right so do it again go out do some damage take cover this time when you go and take cover you find out your stupid teammate closed the door before you could enter so uh not much you can do here don't be this guy wait for your teammates to close the door and then there you go killed by the environment but yeah like this time uh my teammate had no clue but this boss is very very easy you just have to know the pattern so go out do some damage take cover when it's time to take cover and then wait you go back out there second time there will be a wave of enemies just kill the enemies and do the same thing shoot the boss in the back boom bingo it's easy easy so guys uh hope you guys will get better teammates if everyone out there watch my video uh of course it will be much easier for everyone to finish this thing so thanks for watching if it helped please uh hit the like and leave a comment i will see you guys soon take care